Hi. <clears throat> hey everybody, welcome back to my YouTube page on your guy Jimmy Greenfield. And I'm here for some bit Taylor updates. As you all know that I always share my highlights at the Independence Home Days. But now that's over and done with, I have now reason to have news for Taylor. First off, she is now the most nominated uh, artist. The VMAs nominees finally came out and she finally got nominated for about 10 awards this year. And to this day, that makes her the most nominated, once again, the most nominated artist in VMAs history. But if she does win most of the night, or if she sweeps the night, then that means she's going to top Queen B for the most uh, wins. <clears throat> Basically for the most wins and trophies for the MTV history in the VMAs. In addition to that, uh, t uh, Sabrina Carpenter also had a, um, Sabrina Carpenter also got nominated too for six uh, awards at VMAs, and she's finally getting some VMA buzz. But even though only four nominations, <clears throat> but even though the, these nominations will keep coming and going, and also uh, Sabrina told Variety that it's, it's always really great to uh, have Taylor to be by her side as her best friend. But I'll actually, I'll actually save that for another time. But right now I also want to say that, well, you know, basically there were thunderstorm warnings, but I'll get to that very shortly. Anyways, I, back, but anyways, back to Taylor. Um, T Taylor's been on a roll, as we know that we're, we're currently, she's currently on her final shows in Europe, and I know that she's gonna wrap up her shows in London in just a few weeks, and that'll be the end, but in the meantime, the Taylor Swift, um, the Taylor Swift concert's still up in the air for Cleveland, and I know Cleveland, if you're out there, from, Ch from ABC Cleveland, from Make That News 5 Cleveland, to Channel 3, Fox A News and everyone else who are watching, please, please don't forget about Taylor Swift. There, there is nothing wrong with the first weekend of October on fourth and fifth to make sure that <clears throat> that is still in the air. That is still in the air and possibility for Taylor Swift to book here in Cleveland, and I we all have to do it for the Cleveland Swifties, Travis Kelsey, as well as Paul Seduti, because I wanted to once again do it on behalf of my Autism Society. For Taylor's sake, as well as the Swifties in Cleveland, say we've been waiting for six years. So make sure <clears throat> I I want to make sure that everything is all great and update. And hopefully, in the meantime, I'll I'll try to get an update in case Taylor gets this, whether it's on social media through X, Instagram, or even Facebook. That hopefully she'll get. I'm looking forward to see what other. What well, others in store for Taylor Swift, and I'll keep you in an update to see what the next video will be about. In the meantime, by the time I'll keep going day by day, we have to get closer and closer to use dice for ticket sales instead of Ticketmaster for wasting time to either getting scammed, scam sellers, or just or just Monopoly playing, which we can't can't ba basically buy tickets that much anymore. And the last conclude I want to say I'm looking forward to see 30 seconds to Mars tomorrow night and I will upload the um, performances. Heck, even on my Sesame Street video, on my Sesame Street YouTube page. But that's pretty much why I got the update for Taylor Swift and what I have things ahead. So uh, hopefully this video will get, <clears throat> will be still worth it and I'll be looking forward to see you guys um, tomorrow. But hopefully somewhere in midday tomorrow because I'm going out to see 30 seconds to Mars. Thank, thanks again for watching, and have a great night.